Hello everyone, I'm going to make a short a short video. Uh, I'm Turquoise, welcome to my channel, my podcast. Uh, I've been talking a lot about something called limerence, an intense obsess obsessive uh, mind on someone, usually someone you can't have. Um, someone suggested to me last weekend that I make up a facsimile or a... Uh, someone that's never been on the planet before, just someone original. And I made an attempt to do that, and I succeeded in making uh, Oleg Reshikikov. But um, I uh, ran into some trouble when I got to know the uh, Tulpa. You can look up Tulpa in the uh, search engine, uh, T-U-L-P-A. It's essentially an adult imaginary friend. Um, as long as you, uh, you know, it's harmless, as long as you can uh, still live in your real life. Well, I realized that I have been using limerence as a drug all my life. And it wasn't just with Olga at the uh, IOP program. It, it's also, uh, it's in my life, it's permeated my whole life. I have used it to feel better about myself and feel better about my life and motivate myself to live. And um, it has its roots in childhood. Um, you can look up limerence, L-I-M-E-R-E-N-C-E, -E -E, and see for yourself. Both professionals and laymen alike have uh, been studying it as of late. Dorothy Tenov was the one who uh, came up with that word limerence, and I'm still not sure how she uh, did that I think she I don't know if she made up the word made up that word like I made up my tulpa but it's obviously necessary I'm finding out that we have to be creative with uh, how we deal with this powerful feeling because it's destroying us um, there is genocide going on in other countries there is war war going on there are other things to worry about that I want to help tackle, like war, and hunger, and um, the love and lovelessness, and limerence. I feel is a key symptom of lovelessness and not having our needs met and being traumatized. In my experience, anyway, and I'm probably sure other people will agree. I'm going to treat it like Alcoholics Anonymous treats alcohol. I have a playlist. Limerence Anonymous. It's not an official 12-step program. I have searched that online and um, The closest I can come to that is Sex and Love Addicts Anonymous. I don't think it's about being addicted to sex and love I think it's about being addicted to how our brain reacts to romantic love and um, I feel like I have to uh, be limerent. I feel like I have to fixate on someone probably the same way I felt like I had to fixate on my stepfather after the divorce when they were telling me to forget about him. And I did forget about him on the surface, but not really. I still had very upset feelings. I was still very messed up. In fact, it was enough to send me into a mental institution for nine months when I was five years old. So, um, and I'm still in the mental health system today and I'm trying to do a mental wellness process and a code of universal ethics to recover from that. And it was caused by environment Mental illness can be environmental, and when you have a mental breakdown, you may need to see a psychiatrist. That's my disclaimer. You may need to see a psychiatrist or a therapist or a doctor to help you get stabilized in your brain. And I'm on a very low dose of medication, and I'm going to take it as prescribed, and I'm going to go to the IOP and face my problems and be able to deal with Olga at my right size and deal with uh, people at my right size. I can't even deal with a fictitious character right now. I don't need the distraction right now that is keeping me sick. Just like an alcoholic can't keep drinking, it's going to keep him sick and it's eventually going to kill him or her. I'm going to treat this the same way. You can feel free to look, at my, look up my playlists. I have a playlist called Limerence Anonymous. I do, I do step study and I share experience, strength, and help, my budding 12-step program. If anybody wants to uh, join me and or uh, talk to me about it, you can message me on this video or you can email me. 
Maybe I'll put down my uh, email address in case someone else is interested in uh, doing this with me. Uh, recovering from limerence. The only dis the only requirement for involvement. I'm not going to say membership because it's not official. The only requirement <laughs> for involvement in Lima, Limerence Anonymous, is a desire to stop being limerent. I'm Turquoise and I'm limerent. <laughs>